Yeah, what up, no advisors? I got troublesome, the beautiful troublesome Austin, Texas. Just got Thank to be tearing you. down the stage at Beats and Beers. She got a lot going on. I told her to let us know on camera because I couldn't keep up. <laughs> let the people know your name again and what the fuck you do. I am troublesome Houston's first lady of hip hop. Uh, right now, I am currently wrapping up on a new film called Harvey, which I'm really excited for the people to see. Um, and I've worked with everybody from fun to trade to slim to become millionaire. And I just do my thing. Hey. How long you been doing music? I've been doing music uh, over 10 years. You know what I mean? So I'm, I'm very much seasoned. Um, I'm an indie artist and I prefer it that way. Okay. Uh, but I'm just out here on my group. Now you just said you prefer it that way. Why not the big labels? Well, the, the label deals that, that I was offered, I, I actually got to sit down and meet with, they wanted me to compromise who I was. They wanted me to change. Whether it was be more gimmicky or be more watchy. Okay. And I was taught to never compromise myself. Fact, so that just wasn't the lane that I wanted to get into. And I, at the end of the day, I believe that real rap sells. Best. Good music sells. Best. And when God's timing happens, it'll all come together. Now, do you mind me asking in what ways they wanted you to compromise yourself? You know, whether it was being raunchy mm. or to be gimmicky. When I say gimmicky, it's like... More commercial? No, not even more commercial, because I, I get commercial, but sometimes you do have to dumb down to sell a record, but it's a dumb down hook. Okay. A dumb down your lyrics, you know what I mean? So I get that part, but it was more so gimmicky, like, just with the extra, just okay. with the, the, the pop, 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 you know what I mean? Just, it wasn't who I was. I'm not, I am who I am. I'm not okay. going to compromise that, and I believe that real rap still sells. Okay. I believe that you can be true to who you are. And I'd have to compromise, it may take you a little longer, but I believe that you, you I believe it's gonna happen. You know what I mean? I don't know really how to say it. And I'm definitely not a raunchy rapper. And nothing against the artists that are, that's just not who I am. Okay. So I'm not gonna false flag or be something that I'm not. Okay. You got your own lane. Absolutely. So if somebody were to say, I heard Troublesome's music and she reminds me of this artist, who would that be? Um, well, I get, as far as my delivery, I've always gotten Fox. And I'm honored oh. because I love Fox. So, so, Legend. Yeah, OG Ohe. Legend. Yeah, I love her. So, um, I've always been compared to as far as delivery and flow-wise. Okay. But as far as my, my lyrics, I can go anywhere from Pop to Chance the Rapper to Kendrick to J. Cole. Like, that's my lane. Like, you know what I mean? Like, I'm that shit. Like, Cali mixed with New York? But I'm so H-Town. Oh. You know what I mean? I just think at the end of the day, if you're a lyricist, it's all about the lyrics. And so everyone that I mentioned are lyricists. Okay. You know what I mean? So I, I, I would say I get compared to all the lyricists. So is this your first time doing Beats and Beers? It is! It Yay! Is. I was so excited when I got the email um, about performing on the stage because um, I've been a fan. I was actually here last year with uh, with some artists just coming to support. Yeah. I think Hustle Game was here, so I came out with them or whatever. And um, the next year, I was, I'm actually performing on the stage, so I was really excited. That's what's up. Power moves. Absolutely. I hit grinding your ass off. Amen. <laughs> what else you got this weekend? Um, Any more shows coming up? I do. I got a show later on tonight um, at the Eleanor. Okay. And then I have a show with Ebony Magazine tomorrow night. Okay. Um, and I got one other show. I can't remember. Forgive me. I can't remember the venue name. Okay. Mm -hmm. Is it on 6th Street? It's definitely on 6th okay. Street. <laughs> We mobbing through. Okay. Um, and I'm just gonna support, you know, Bumby's having a birthday badge tonight. That's my old G. So I'm gonna hey. support him and celebrate his life. That's what's up. Um, but yeah, so I'm just saying. So one time for No Advisory Podcast, we based out of Charlotte, North Carolina, so you know, we feel you on that H Town Absolutely. shit. Let the people know where they can find you on social media. You can holler at me on Instagram at Troublesome Official. That's T R O B U L E S T. Official and that's no, no, Instagram no, no, no. and Facebook, and on Twitter, it's just trouble. That's what's up. Yes, bang. Thank you so much, Miss Troublesome. She's so beautiful. You are gorgeous. Hey, thank you. Black, black, bang.